Uh, Bonnie is, um, yeah, she's, um, she's incredible. And, and I, I know uh, she's well deserving of this, of this honor. She teaches aerospace engineering and can speak as a pilot, right? So she's, <laughs> she's a licensed commercial pilot, had you know, worked for American Airlines for 12 years. Um, prior to that, she was an Air Force fighter jet pilot. In my class has been building uh, quadcopters, and the quadcopter will have a uh, GoPro mounted on it, and they will be doing video surveillance of the river area. Well, I'm more concerned about the aerospace aspect, like how a quadcopter flies, how to control it, the rules behind operating it, uh, the future. Uh, the growth in part of the aerospace industry right now is uh, UAVs or unmanned aerial vehicles and that's just what I want them to take away is like this is a huge growth area and a very possible for them to get jobs in this area. The students bring with them uh, an array of uh, great talents, um, they're, they're really good in their home languages, their barrier is English. So everything has a purpose and, and every, um, I, I think maybe when we were in school, uh, I, I didn't really get math because it didn't make sense to me about the application. Everything that she teaches has an application. And whether it's in uh, aerospace or whether it's in some application of, of flight or if it's in uh, the engineering field or in a job field about how math is used, she's got the examples for kids to understand why they're learning math. And that, that's, for an ELL kid, that's everything. Our kids are just really great. They're nice and they're polite and I just feel like we have a great group of students and a great group of teachers and it's just a, a very more of a sense of community than you might get in a larger high school or even in other high schools because for a lot of these kids we're like their family and uh, it's just a really neat kind of experience because you're in a situation where the kids really enjoy being there. We have to kick them out at the end of the school day and uh, it's just a nice place to work. So.